Hi, this is Alex at one of my family's favorite places, Blue Koi with Scott, for compliments of the chef with 435 Magazine. So Scott, can you please tell us a little bit about Blue Koi? Blue Koi was started in 2002 and is actually owned by four siblings, my three older sisters and myself. And we have so much fun opening this store and all the staff that works with us and it's been so, so, so great. Um, and also all the, all the guests, such as you and your family, that comes here quite a bit and uh, we really love having you here all the time. So uh, it's just been so much fun uh, having this restaurant. We certainly love coming here. Oh, thanks. And so I think we have two of your appetizers, some dumplings and fried tofu. So can you please tell us a little bit about that? Sure. Thanks, Jeff. Okay. All right, so these are two of our most popular appetizers, right? Um, so one of them here is the crispy tofu with awesome sauce. And this is actually organic tofu with snow pea pots. And this is our um, awesome sauce. I mean, the awesome sauce is really a famous secret. It's got 13 different ingredients. And then when you taste it, you'll know how awesome it is. So obviously, you know. All right, cool. And then um, this is our pan fried chicken dumplings. And it's got marinated chicken inside. And it's actually, everything here is handmade from scratch. And it's made by hand. And then we pan shirt it to golden, a little bit crispy on the outside. And it comes with a, um, a homemade dipping sauce, which is like a soy sauce and a light vinegar and onion base. So it's absolutely delicious. It already smells really good. Yeah, I know, you wanna eat some? <laughs> and next I think we have my personal favorite, black bean chicken. So can you please tell me about that? Sure, absolutely. Thanks again, Joe, appreciate it. Okay, so this black bean chicken is also one of my favorite because it's got so many different complex flavors in it. And it's white meat chicken with um, green bell peppers and red bell peppers, portobello mushrooms, and just a touch of jalapeno peppers in it just to add a little kick to it. And also it's on top of this homemade noodles which we make ourselves daily. And we uh, painstakingly just roll it and then cut it and then cook it to perfection. And it's absolutely delicious, it's so savory. So you got, I know, I know you love it, I know your family love it, so. And I think they're bringing out something else, so. Oh, absolutely, what's coming okay. Out? Thank you, Joe. So the next course, which is the organic tofu in curry sauce. And um, the main ingredients is organic tofu, of course, and then also uh, bud mushrooms, um, onions, and also um, snow pea pods and fresh basil. And all sauteed together, you really combine all these um, kind of like eastern flavors together with the fresh vegetables. And uh, it has this really nice, sweet, and also nutty flavor to it. It is just heavenly. I love it. And now they're bringing us your wonton soup, so tell oh, yeah. me about that. Thank you so much, Joe. All right, okay. So this wonton soup, the base is actually fresh chicken broth. So we make our broth ourselves um, every single day fresh. We actually make it twice a day. Okay, and in, the, in this wonton soup, see how big it is? It has um, fresh spinach, bean sprouts, and then has the uh, cilantro and onions. And in this, in this broth has this huge giant wontons. And this wontons actually is actually, um, it's a type of dumpling with meat wrappings in the middle, okay? And it has um, shrimp, chicken, and pork, and uh, a little bit of onions and light ginger, all marinated in this uh, different uh, marinade in it, and then wrapped in this wonton wrapping. So when you, when you eat this meal, and then it has also um, noodles on the bottom as well. So this is actually a complete meal. It's a soup meal, and uh, it's absolutely delicious. And it's so comforting. So this is the most absolutely popular uh, when the weather is a little bit on the chilly side. So this is really, when you, when you eat this one time serve, you just feel warmth and comfort. Definitely looks like a feel good meal. So. All right. And now you got some of your bubble tea, so. Yes. Tell me about that, please. All right. Thank you so much. Thank Jeff. you. All right, okay, right there, all right. Okay, so um, we have this bubble tea here. Now, this is just a small selection of like 20 different flavors that we have. Uh, we have a, a sweet chero and a fresh strawberry, it's a fresh uh, puree, and passion fruit, and this one's a honeydew. So this is just kind of um, a small choices that we have, but um, what bubble teas really are, they're basically just like flavored tea lattes. And we make them three ways. We make them on ice like these, or frozen into a smoothie, or we make them warm as well for cold weathers. And um, if you look at these drinks, on the bottom of these drinks, uh, actually the tapioca balls, right? And they're kind of chewy gummies, sweet um, um, gummy bear balls, you know? And that's what we call it, the bubbles. And then the, the flavors all have teas in it. Some of the teas has black tea in it, and some of them have green tea in it. 
And if we can even make it caffeine free, or we can make it you know lighter sweet or extra sweet or extra bubbles. So we have different sort of type of modifications that our customer can and request for. I know they're my sister's favorite. So oh yeah. Thank you. Yeah, she likes this uh, bubble tea, uh, terrible bubble tea. And then once again, can you please tell me about your hours and location? Oh sure, yeah. Um, we are Monday to Thursday uh, from 11 to 9:30, and then Friday and Saturday uh, is from 11 to 10:30, and we are located at 105th and Mission Road uh, in Leewood, Kansas. Scott, thank you so much. This has been Alex at Blue Koi with for 435 Magazine for compliments of the chef. See you next time.